last seven children, so uh, and I'm the number six kid. So out of what we would do is around the neighborhood all the time, we would always be playing with the other kids, and I would always be like mimicking. You know, I'd see something on TV, and I go out and like maybe you know like just a little mockingbird. So the mailman, you know, came up to my mom one day and said, you know, I said, Larry's, you know, he's always kind of in showing here and there. He said, you know, why don't you take him to this, this woman I know who teaches, you know, acting lessons to a kid. You think he'd, he'd like that. And I was four years old or something at the time, you know. So she asked me, she said, do you want to, you know, go and do these acting lessons from this woman who teaches kids? I said, sure, why not? I got no problem with that. And uh, <laughs> so she did and we went and we and, uh, and, and the mailman basically put us in touch and so I went to Lois Hour was her name and, and did my first, you know, what, six, eight months with her. And then as that was going on, she would hold um, showcases for agents to come in to see if they would want to, you know, represent children. So uh, the Halliburton Agency, Gene Halliburton Agency, which primarily did just children. So they came in and they saw me do a piece out of a thousand clowns, actually, believe it or not. And um, they said, yeah, we'd love to represent them. So, you know, they told my mom, okay, so they did. And, and shortly after that, I got you know a call and they wanted us to interview for something called the Dick Van Dyke Show pilot they were doing. And I remember going into Carl's office, and he says, you know, he says, oh, and he talked to me for a while, just you know. And he says, well, can you pretend like you're sick for me? I said, sure. So he says, well, lay down on the couch. You got a big stomach ache, and then want you do that. And I did that, and he had me do a couple other things. And can you, you know, tell Daddy you love cupcakes, but you don't want one because you're too sick for us? I said, sure. I did that, and that's part of the show. And, and uh, you know, next thing I know, they called back and said, well, we'd like to use them for the pilots. So, right place at the right time, I guess.